Okay. Hi, um, I have two questions. The first one's really quick. Um, first, what are your favorite house words? Um, and then also, um, I assume you quickly developed a final outcome for the story after originally creating it. Uh, but at some points, you also made changes like uh, the inclusion of like a five-year gap. Um, so I was wondering if there were any other major deviations or character choices that you made and later thought better of. Uh, my favorite house words are definitely "Winter is coming." That's the one I I write, uh, you know, repeatedly uh, when I'm uh, when I used to do inscriptions uh, on sign books. Um, I haven't actually gotten to the end yet, so I don't know if there are going to be other major changes. It's it's possible, but I, I don't. I think the broad outlines are going to remain the same. You know, I I know where some of the major characters are going, how they're going to end up, how it's going to resolve. But there are a, the devil is in the details, and there's a lot of stuff that occurs when you're actually writing the the books. I don't know. You you dealt with some of this. Uh, I'm, I'm you and Harriet with with. Jordan, I'm sure. Uh, Jim always said that he, he knew the last scene yep. uh, when he wow. when he started. So, did did he entrust that to Harriet, and did Brandon write the last scene that that uh, Jim had originally envisioned? Yeah, he did, yeah. And that was like 20 years later, right? 20 years later. But of course, then he was thinking it was going to be a trilogy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm sorry, I'm You're already concerned. forgetting the first question. Yeah. I, I keep forgetting there's two questions at a time. I, I'm old and, and feeble, so. <laughs>